What is up guys, it's Razor, and welcome back to Empty Bottle and Default Armor Challenge Run of Roddy Out of Stories. In the previous episode, we had a meeting with the non-humans, and then Parsec showed up, and he was telling us about the dragons. And in this episode, we're going to head to the Black Goblin Village. So, that's all we're going to go do right now. So I'm not sure if we can recruit at this point. Um, I think we can. But I'm not sure what characters we can actually recruit at this time. So I'm going to go ahead and sleep, actually. And see if we can recruit anybody on the next day. And then we'll go Alright, so I guess we can't recruit Nam at this time. I thought we could. Anyway, we got Martinez and Santos in our party. And... I do not sell the Rainbow Crystal. I mentioned this earlier in that game as well as we were playing, but do not sell this. It may be tempting to sell it because it sells for 10,000, but it's used to recruit a character later on, so. And I believe there's only like one or two of them in the game. Okay, we can get Martha and Keen. So they each have their own shop and I think one of them sells items and one of them sells like accessories, I think. I'm not 100% sure. Alright, so we gotta go ahead to uh, talk to Lord Zane. So let's go ahead and go over and do that. Alright, so we gotta go ask one of the dwarfs who owns the shop. Which is this dwarf right here. Okay, so now we're going to talk to Clarence. So this mission's like a wild goose chase, pretty much. Clarence is right here. Okay, so the dwarf said Keen, and now this person's going to say Marsha.
Alright, so now we have to back, head back and talk to Lord Zane. So it's like a back and forth thing. Yeah, that's a good idea. So yeah, Lord Zane with a great idea that they should both open up shop and that's probably for the best. Alright, so I'm not really sure how to recruit them though. We'll have to. Come again. I'll come back. I'll come back in a little bit. I know we can get, we can recruit friends. He's right here. <laughs> you failed, bro. Uh, yes. Alright, so I guess we're going to go watch them battle. Yep, practice makes perfect. Yep, there you go. Alright, so to recruit the shopkeepers, we have to buy 10,000 uh, daggles worth of stuff from their shops a piece. So I think I'll buy. A beckoning cat. Oh no, wait, that's not good. Um, Pluto's trophy's better. Come again. And this will increase the amount of daggles that we get. Even though I don't really need to buy anything really, except for herbs. Uh, herbs later on. Other than that, I don't think I really need to buy anything else. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm gonna buy five revival stones. Said to buy ten thousand worth. We already we just did that. Welcome. Come again. All right, so I'm not really sure what we got to do. I guess we got to sleep maybe, and come back the next day. It'd probably be best to save it before you do any of this because I don't know exactly why <clears throat> I'm not able to recruit them. But we'll get them eventually. And we get friends. So, you got to do what I did earlier in the episode. Talk to him and he'll go battle a uh, get a uh, gill. And then you just sleep until the next day. Thanks a bunch. I guess I might have to wait until... Alright, I'm not sure what I gotta do. Okay, we have to actually leave the fort, that's why, okay. So we leave the fort and we get a cutscene. Okay, yeah, here's a cutscene. This is Grigory. And we can actually recruit him. I believe he can like blind the enemies or something like that. Because he, sp he spits like booze in their face or something like that. Or maybe he blinds himself. I don't know. So we have to head to Vladimir, okay. Hi. 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 Let's go talk to Vladimir. Okay, so now we gotta go talk to Naom, I guess. Alright, so we gotta go talk to the Naom. Or Nom, Naom, I don't know what his name is. Naom, I don't even know. Doesn't really matter though, I guess. I guess you can pronounce it however you want. Okay, so now we're gonna talk to David. And David's actually a really good character. You can actually recruit David later. He's a very good character.
And we get the dwarf beer. So now let's go talk to Gregory, or Gregory, should I say. Go give him the beer. And he gives us some daggles. And then I believe we can talk to him later and we can recruit him. Okay, we gotta remove someone from our party. Because we gotta put Coco in there, so we'll remove Santos. And we get Grigory. Now we should be able to get Martha and Keen as well. Now that we saw that uh, scene or whatever with Coco. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I was supposed to buy after I after I saw that scene. We get Naom or Naom Naom. I don't even know how to pronounce his name, guys. <clears throat> I'm just going to say Naom. Let me go ahead and put Gregory in my party just to see what he does. I forget. Have a drink. A break to have a drink. Slightly heals himself. Yeah, this is the move right here. Alcohol breath. So he spews alcohol from his mouth at the foe. What a waste. I believe that can uh, a blind though. <clears throat> if I remember correctly. So Martinez is probably the strongest of character to put in our party. But I like I like friends. So I'm gonna put friends in my party. So let's start to Martha. Because I guess you got to talk to her twice. <clears throat> and we get Marsha. I call her Martha. <laughs> but her name's Marsha. And we get Keen as well. So we can actually get Serva and uh, Gil as well. Uh, we can only get Serva at a certain time though when he's training. And then I believe Gil we can get at any time. We just have to battle him. He's a pretty tough character though. Yeah. 
Alright, so if we win, we can recruit him. Okay, so he's level 34. He has 883 HP and he can freeze you. Watch out for a sword, uh, sword attack because it does a lot of damage. I'm trying to poison him, but it's not working. He might have some resistance, resistance to poison or something. Or he might have pretty good luck. Yeah, I guess we're doing it the hard way. That is really annoying. Ah, uh, no. Oh, that was close. This sword attack does so much damage. You cannot dodge that either, that's so annoying. Obviously it's not that hard if you have like armor and you didn't have an empty bottle equipped, so something to keep in mind. Obviously you'll have a lot easier time battling this person than, than what I'd. Stay away. Why oh, you got hit so hard? The sword attack does leave him vulnerable though, I noticed. Let's go ahead and use the vaulty attack. Limit break. I'll take a chunk of his HP and finish him off too. Nice. See, he's pretty tough. But we got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. I'm actually going to put him in my party because he's like really good. He's probably the best, best non-human that you can put in your party at this point in the game. We can also get Serva as well, but we got to battle him as well. He's a lot weaker than Gil, though. I 
And he's obviously easier to dodge too. You could just easily just beat him down and not get hit. <clears throat> but that is literally all the characters that we can recruit at this point in the game. Oh, I guess you gotta wait and battle on the next day, I guess. I, think you, I guess you have to battle multiple times. And that is rain that you hear, so if you hear rain, my bad. Not really much I could do about the weather. It's coming down pretty hard outside. But I'm about to end the episode anyway, so it don't really matter. I wouldn't mind getting server though before I end the episode. That way I don't have to recruit him later. Alright, so let's go talk to Serva and see, see what he says. Okay, so you actually have to battle him on three different days. I didn't know that. Okay. So, I'm going to wait outside because you can only battle him outside. <clears throat> and I'll resume the video whenever he shows up. And we'll battle him a second time and then we'll battle him a third time. So, I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm back, and as you can tell, he's training. Let's go ahead and battle him a second time. Not sure why you have to battle him three times, but whatever. Yeah, he's fairly easy though. Alright, right, so now we just got to battle him one more time. So now let's go back to the room and sleep. And then we'll battle him on the next day. I'm also going to put uh, Gil in my party as well. Put that Final Fantasy currency in my party. He's level 34. <clears throat> so he's like very good at this point in the game. Alright, so pretty much deja vu of Yesterday, I'm going to cut the video here and until he shows up and then I'll resume the video. Be right back. Alright, I'm back and as you can tell, he's training again. So I'll battle him one more time. And after this battle, we'll be able to recruit him. No damage that time.
All right, so now we'll be able to recruit him finally. When we get Serva. <clears throat> All right, so I'm going to go back to the room and save it. And I'm also going to end the episode here. I want to thank you guys for watching. Oh, yeah, and th that's all the characters you can recruit at this point in the game, by the way. But yeah, thank you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next episode. And later.